D&G Equipment Sales on Dunmore Ridge Road in Augusta is your source for both new and used farm equipment needs. With an awesome service department, it's time to buy red and save green at D&G Equipment Sales. Welcome to Weekend Preview, your online news source for happenings and events across Hampshire County. I'm Greg Larry for HampshireReview.com. This is Weekend Preview for September 19th, 20th, and 21st. On Saturday, there will be a championship bull riding competition held to raise money for the Springfield Valley Volunteer Fire Company. The fourth annual competition will be held at the Crystal Valley Ranch on Route 28 just north of Romney. Gates open at 5.30 p.m. with a competition beginning at 7.30 p.m. The competition is sanctioned by SEBRA, the Southern Extreme Bull Riding Association, which is the largest bull riding association in the United States. In addition to entertainment for all ages, there will be food and refreshments available. I caught up with Lieutenant Jim Woodson from the Springfield Fire Company to find out more about the event. Jim, uh, what time does the event start on Saturday? The gates open at 5.30, the event starts at 7.30. Uh, you're saying that the, these are the same guys you see flying through the air on television when they're on the back of those bulls? Yeah, you'll see the same guys that you see on TV will be up here at Crystal Valley Ranch this Saturday. Can you give us a little rundown of just some of the events? I know besides the championship bull riding, some of the other things that are going to be going on Saturday. They'll have, we'll have an event called what they call mutton busting. It's where uh, kids can come up and uh, ride sheep, basically. And then we have what they call a steer branding. They take paint, and uh, you have to teams of three, and you have to wrestle steers down and brand them with the paint. Okay, and besides all the entertainment with the uh, rodeo and everything, are there going to be food, refreshments, and that type of things for people? Yeah, we're going to have uh, food, uh, drinks, funnel cakes, uh, just basically things like that for everybody to enjoy themselves. It's going to be a family event for everybody to enjoy. And you're saying about sponsors, uh, you're real happy with some of the sponsors coming through. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Well, this year our main sponsor is uh, Shanholtz Collision. Where do the proceeds uh, go towards? The proceeds go back to the fire department and we use it for various things uh, to buy new equipment if we need it or whatever we so need. Other events happening this weekend are on Friday a cruise end for cancer patient Jack Norris will be held at 6 p.m. at Mayhew Chevrolet. On Saturday, Romney Cycles is having an open house for their new location in the industrial park on Route 28. The new location allows this already nationally ranked motorcycle and ATV dealership even more space to work with. There will be free hot dogs and soda from noon until 1. Also, motocross and X Game champions Travis Pastrana and Doug Gust will be appearing from 1 until 3 for pictures and autographs. The Team Suzuki Race Team Semi will be there from 11 until 1 p.m. If you haven't seen Romney Cycles' new facility, you should check it out. Also on Saturday, a farmer's market will be held from 9 until noon on Main Street beside the Bank of Romney. The Potomac Eagle Excursion Train departs at 11.30 p.m. An arts festival will be held at the Glass House Studio on Route 50 east of Romney from noon until 4 with live music by Mountain Mama. On Saturday, the 6th annual Todd Giffen Volleyball Tournament will begin at 10.30 at the Cape and Bridge Fire Hall. On Sunday, a film made by Hampshire County native Catherine Pancake called Black Diamonds will be debuted at 3 p.m. at the First United Methodist Church on North High Street, Romney. The award-winning film is about mountaintop removal and other surface mining activities and the issues resulting from the mining. Hope you have a great weekend.